Hello, my name is Jeff Ryan. I'm a CX Solutions Advisor for ASAR America. In previous videos, I've demonstrated Gmail and Outlook's integration with SAP Sales Cloud. Today, I'll demonstrate how SAP Sales Cloud's out-of-box solution can be used to improve your emailing solutions. Everything from sales leads to customer support can fill up your inbox quickly, making it harder to manage. SAP Sales Cloud allows for you to receive emails directly into your Sales Cloud solution and respond to them quickly. Website information forms and customer support tickets can be sent directly to your SAP Sales Cloud solution also. In preparation for this demo, I've sent myself an email from my subdomain email address. I sent this email, uh, Q4 project is the header, the subject line. I'm asking for a demo of the SAP Sales Cloud solution. My exchange or my subdomain receives this in and then forwards that email onto my solution. So if I go into home here, I go down to activities, I go to emails, you will see the Q4 project. This has been sent directly to my Sales Cloud uh, solution. Here's where the email came from. If I scroll down, you'll see the body of this email matches the body of the email that was sent. Now from this email, I could create new activities such as appointments, tasks, phone calls, etc. Since this is regarding you know, a demo, I'm going to go ahead and I'll set up a follow-up call. Preparations, I already did that. I set up a follow-up call for this. So let's create a new one. Let's do, here we actually will create a appointment for this. Let's say the phone call went well and the client wants to have an appointment. You'll see that from the email, SAP has actually pulled in the subject, pulled in the account for us, and is even setting up a recommended date regarding my calendar open dates. So it is synced to my calendar and realizes that I have an open time at 12 p.m. I'll keep that the same. The location, I'll put ASAR's Naperville location. Okay. And notes, I'll just say this is a follow up meeting from the call. Okay. Attendees, it automatically will pull in ASAR like it did for the email. I'll save this. And now you'll see that I have an appointment as well as a phone call that was set up earlier. This is a great way of keeping your emails and your appointments all combined together. This gives a support technician or a sales rep the information and the steps they need right from a one-stop shop. So I got my email in, and now just from this one email section here, I can see my follow-up items. I can even put related items such as a customer complaint form I could add into here. Uh, attachments, if there's an attachment to the email, it will come in here also. You'll see that this is just a script that I sent in. So this will keep track of it. So if a customer filled out, for instance, a complaint sheet, this will be filled in with the information. So as a sales rep, I could click on this and see exactly what their issue is and relate it to the, or forward it on to the people that go to solve that issue. But receiving emails isn't the only function that can be performed in SAP Sales Cloud. Sending email blasts can be very beneficial to any business. Email blasts could be anything from monthly newsletters to upcoming sales campaigns. So let's go ahead and send an email blast. Uh, in preparation of the video, I did send an email blast out to myself. So let's go to email blast here. I sent out this ASARS news conference letter here. This is an invitation to our clients to come and visit us at our SAP lo or ASAR location here, and it's regarding our upcoming winter festival conference. So for the subject line, I put ASAR conference, the target group. Now target groups are important because target groups give you the ability to send the same email, email to multiple people. So think of this as a mass list of, I could click, of everyone I want to contact for this certain campaign or maybe for clients that have a limited time offers. 
I could send them direct emails all just within one click shop. Just click it and send it to thousands of people. And from there, target target group results can be gener- can generate reports in SAP Sales Cloud, such as how many people opened it, how many people deferred and replied back that they would like not like to be part of the newsletter anymore. All this information can be generated into a report. In this section here, you'll see if there's any replies. There's no replies, but these replies will fill in such as, please take me off your mailing list, or we're very interested in this offer. And from there, you can create leads and other tasks from right in here from this the results from the, uh, the target groups. Okay, we can see that it was executed. This gives you execution details, tells you who was contacted. So if I go now to my exchange here, you're going to see that we have an email. This is the conference. It's the conference here will match the subject, and it will match our from here. So if we go down here to our from, you'll see that that matches also. And this is what contained in our, this is what I sent them. And if they would like to, they could click on this feature here, and that will add them to a removal list. Okay. Accept this. Okay. Using SAP Sales Cloud's out-of-box email feature gives you the upper hand when performing customer service and marketing. Thank you for watching, and stay on the lookout for more ASAR America videos.